It was a mild, mild day. Flirting with 70 degrees today. Newark got to 70 degrees. Here in the big town, we were in the upper 60s. You cannot match numbers like that. This time of year, it's a gift. Now, what's going to happen is a couple of scattered showers are going to come through the area between 1 a.m. and about 7 a.m. That's one. 63 degrees, gift. 63 degrees up to the north. A storm developing well to our south. That's the one that made headlines in Florida. We'll kick out to sea. There it goes well out to sea. Leading average cold from falls apart as it comes through. So again, uh, between 1 a.m. and about 6, 7 a.m., maybe a couple of scattered showers about. Then the day is going to feature a little bit of a breeze. The temps are going to try and hold steady. And then tomorrow night, the temps really go on down. And Sunday will be a flat-out chilly day and Monday even chillier. The European model, as we head into next week, shows rain arriving here on Tuesday. I think that looks good Tuesday in the morning morning into the afternoon night. It's a wet solution with a secondary low forming late in the game. Some snow up and over the hills in New England. That's good for Thanksgiving in the ski areas. Have a good time up there. But for us, it looks like the GFS model is uh, a little bit colder in terms of a solution. They have snow in the onset, and that's going to be on Wednesday, north of the city. And uh, here in the city itself, uh, could end up with a flake or two, and doubt it. But again, uh, it's a Tuesday night, especially into Wednesday early event or Tuesday afternoon night into early Wednesday then out and then Thanksgiving is going to be flat out chilly around here. That's how we see it. So there's a little drama in this map because we're going to go from very mild to a little bit of wet to really cold to much colder as we approach Thanksgiving. The gusty wind for tomorrow, that'll go 20, 30 miles per hour. Not out of the question, and Glad Cruz uh, has that in there. Sunday, back half of the week, it's good. Look at the chill coming on Monday and Tuesday. And Wednesday, remember the storm now, Tuesday wet, Tuesday afternoon night into Wednesday. Turkey Day looks chilly, and Friday as well.